Good girl. All right. Away. Well, we headed up on the mountain to try to find some bear. We get done doing that. We're gonna go look for Jacob's deer. And then we're gonna call today. Well, up on the mountain, we're gonna try to find us a bear this morning. She's a little bit chilly. Catch us a big slew foot. Hey, what you doing, girl? I know you like them ovens. Good boy, good boy. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, always needing help, ain't you? Let's go, Ridge. Come on. Oh, you want help, too? Good boy. I love when they do that. The decision this morning is to uh, drop off in the timber, not been seeing. You know, up here in this open country, the bears ain't been crossing these roads like they have been in, in the earlier part of the season and stuff. So I'm gonna drop down this on this point here, and I'm gonna walk around towards Caden and Jacob. That's gonna be in the jeep with a couple of dogs. See if we can't get something jumped up in this timber to where they can cut in and, and help these dogs out. So that's the game plan. Are you ready? There definitely ain't near the bear movement that there has been two weeks ago to the, as there is today. I mean, there's, there's very few bears still out. So I think if we find any, they're going to be in the timber. They're not going to be up in the open. Oh, what is it? What is it? Let's go. Storm, Ridge. Back, back. Yep. Storm, storm. All right. Well, the storm them just hunting around. I'm just free casting them and seeing what to come up with. That's how I've been hunting them all year. And it's worked out a couple times, and it's not worked out a couple times, so uh, we'll get out of this thicket I'm in and see if we can catch up with them. They ain't open up or nothing. I just like, I like staying with them. We're just gonna keep on walking around through here, seeing if we can't find us a track. I thought that they was gonna get one to go on there. False alarm. So I've dropped way off here. You can see up on top, and I'm I'm just walking these old uh, skid roads, prospect roads, seeing what we come up with. She's pecked around a little bit, just once or twice, like she smelled something. I saw an old froze in track up there in the snow, but it's probably two days old. And we got down here no snow now, so I'm just gonna walk this out. And Jacob and them's gonna go around through there and see if they can't get Ridge, he got out of here on something they're gonna go around check him and i'm just gonna keep on walking storm down through here and go on to the bottom see if maybe jump something up just see if you pick him up if you don't pick him up close 
Head on down the hall road there, okay? She's a hammering. 500 yards in front of us. Well, I'd like to have him. He'd be a good one to cut loose here because she's definitely on a bear and she's taking it off this point going towards the hall road. See if you can, uh, ah, uh, hell. Run out there. Maybe, is he on that bottom road? He's a couple hundred yards in front of us. I'm gonna step out here and see if I can get him real quick. Thank you. And then just come on down the hall road and I'll, I'll talk to y'all then. Got up in this thick stuff here. She's a hammer, definitely. Running a, a bear. We'll uh, get down here and see what she's doing. It's gonna take me a minute to get down this mountain, you hear me? But traffic only, man. <laughs> Let's see if we can't. I can't keep up with them going downhill, but I just need to get down there with them. So, Storm jumped that bear and took it out of the holler and then crossed and went across the hall road but got high walled. Jacob and Caden come down the road and she was just going back and forth in the road. So I, I told them to try to get it going again. Well, they couldn't. So I told them come down and get me in the holler. They come down and got me in with Storm. And then when we went back up and I was looking on the GPS of where she'd come up out of the holler and try to cross the road and going back and forth, that bear got up over the high wall and she couldn't. So I'm gonna grab Ridge because I need him for the chase. And then we're gonna go back over there and get above the high wall. There's a little road that goes up there and should be able to get this bear going again. So that's the game plan. I just need to grab this other dog because I need, need as much dog power as I can get. Y'all gotta come out of there. You hear me? I'm unaware. Y'all hey, just come out of your skin or something. Come out of there. It's just the same. Come out of there. Try to wake up, Jacob. You guys are gonna get hyped up. Yeah, man. I, I'm trying to, uh, you know, I'm trying to get over here and get this thing. Huh? There's your muffin. I don't know who that was. Mine. <laughs> you can have the rest of the muffin, Bubby. I got a cliff bar if you want a cliff bar. I usually just, I just hold on to it just in case I'm kind of down. That's what happened to me, but uh, when I'm when I'm when I finally get to the tree, I, I kind of de-energize. I kind of eat me a little something there. case up here I put a radio and a GPS in there for Zach you got the big radio in the Jeep so you can communicate that way uh, you'll have to stay with the Jeep if Zach goes around you go with Zach and then I'm gonna take the dogs up here come on, come on Bing come on Bing Pootered, maybe. It's all right, though. It's straw. Tightens it up, you just reach in there and throw it out. Yeah, I will. Come on, Storm. <laughs> he said Storm. you are. Storm, let's go. Oh, I will. You ain't got to worry about that. Get you a nice handful of that warm dog food. So, I'm got, <clears throat> got the ridge caught and uh, I got back over here to where that bear come up over the high wall. So getting these dogs back in here, I fully expected that bear went on around through here. And 
didn't come this way. So I'm gonna get out here and I would say that bear got in this ditch, I guess, and run around this holler. storm had a lose and we went down here zach took days down here to the track the bear's right here in the hole we got vehicles coming up the road we got to the jeep real fast but i'm just gonna sit here and watch the bear and then we're gonna, we'll get together and get it took care of right before we get out of the road you mean to let dogs loose no not yet but i want you to just get out of the road for now and then just stay right here and then we'll kick him out i mean i got right there and seen Y'all just uh Come out that way. There he is, right there. There he is. There he is. There he is. There he is. Right, right. Zach, he comes out again. You all on him? If he comes out again, turn your scope down. Here he comes. There we go. That's all right. That's all right. Get him. Get in there, dog. Come on. Come on, Storm. All right. Is he going up? I think. Oh, no, he's three. Three. There we go. Yes, yeah, sir. Right there. there we go. Good bear. Yeah. Heck yeah. Big fatty. Yes, sir. Hey, how about you now? Let's go, baby. That couldn't work out no more perfect. No dogs hurt. <laughs> Nothing. In a dangerous hole. Right. Yes, baby. Right, hey. You make that call. Guy. You want to kill him? I got this guy from the run. I know. Oh, my God. 
As you can see, we got a hanger. The bear's dead in the split of the tree, so if we don't have a chainsaw, we don't have no sticks, we don't have nothing. That bear, I've run him way over yonder. And uh, Storm brought him over here, or her, I, we don't know if it's a boar in the cell yet. But got this hole burrowed out. I guarantee you, that's been a bed for him before. And she's just laying in there, and Storm made a miss, a lose coming up through here. The road's right here in the high wall. And I ended up going around the rim and Zach come up and helped me. And then he took a dog down here where he found a track on the GPS and then found a bear track and cut a dog loose right there, cut Ridge loose. And Ridge come, what, 80, 90 yards? Yeah. And come 69 up here, yards is what it 69 is. 69 yards come up here. And I was over top and Zach was blowing. And he started to sound like he's face barking, like he's looking at one. And I finally come down here and got to an angle where I could see the black fur and that bear was in here and we ended up cutting the dogs loose. And he ran about 20 yards and treed up. Couldn't ask for a better day. Dogs is fine. Good bear. Now it's time to just get out of here. If we can. I guess I'll just lead us a path, man. Yeah, I'll just wait on you. Well, we got it done. It took a little bit find that bear after storm made a lose but i don't think that uh, i think it was just so fresh that she just passed it up and so close to the road and she was going back and forth on that high wall it was the best scenario best location that we could have hoped for uh, jacob made a hell of a shot ethical one shot bear was out had a little had a little trouble getting him out. <laughs> Left a little hanger in there, but got him out. Got him took care of. Got all of our pictures. Heading back to the trailer now, and I'm headed down to uh, see a family. Zach and I lost one of our good buddies last night in a tragic car accident, and uh, and he's hunted with us. Jordan Butcher's hunted with us. Been on, gosh, I don't know how many videos with the Untamed bear hunting, deer hunting, and Trace Boone, his brother. We just want to pray for their family and, and the others that was lost in a, a tragic car accident. This bear today was for you, Jordan. I enjoyed our time together in the woods, buddy. Okay. Right there he is. Oh my gosh. We got him, baby. We got him. We got him, man. We got him. We got him. Oh my goodness. Look at that. Look at that, Trace. Just look at it. Oh my. Six on your right side. Oh my God. Look at the mass. Oh my God. Look at this deer.